Hi, I'm Satwit, and in this presentation, I'm going to talk about the Ferrari Apprenticeship Program. This program is one of a kind. It, it lets participants work while they study with Ferrari. An apprentice gets an opportunity to become either a service or repair technician, parts advisors, service advisors, body paint and MET technician. It's a three year long course and is undertaken at one of the many Ferrari dealerships across the country. The brief of this assignment mentions designing a public relations campaign where Ferrari North Europe can attract 14 to 18 year olds at the apprenticeship programs kiosk at the Ferrari Challenge UK series of races. The brief asks us to create a program that will occur on the four race weekends in 2020 on various racetracks across the country. The Ferrari Challenge Series is a part of the Corsa Client T service provided by the Italian sports car giant. This service is for those who buy race cars and take part in the One Make Race Series. There are a few programs in this service. One is the Ferrari Challenge Series which uses the 488 Challenge cars. Another is the XX program where the customers can buy and race hardcore Ferrari cars dubbed as the XX versions of those cars. The last is the F1 Client T where the lucky few customers who bought the decommissioned Formula 1 cars race them against each other around the world. Ferrari itself is a huge brand and was until recently under the Fiat Chrysler umbrella. It is known for its involvement in motorsports, especially Formula 1. It has been dominating the sports for years and is probably the most well-known and the oldest team. Apart from motorsports, it is also widely renowned for its supercars. The costliest car ever sold at an auction was the Ferrari 250 GTO Berlinetta for a whopping £28 million. Their current lineup includes the F8 Tributo, F8 Spider, Portofino, Roma, 812 Superfast, 812 GTS, SF90 Stradali, GTC4 Lusso and the GTC4 Lusso T. So, to attract the young adults to the apprenticeship program's kiosk at the Challenge Series, I propose the following. Ferrari can begin by providing a hands-on experience to the attendees. They can showcase the work that the apprentices undertake at Ferrari. They can carry decommissioned body panels and mechanical parts along with them to the races as props for the hands-on experience. Getting first-hand experience will showcase to the young adults how the work is conducted. Additionally, the current apprentices can also be present at the stand to provide a one-on-one -on -one conversation with interested candidates. A hands-on experience along with a personal conversation with an existing apprentice will help potential apprentices to gauge how the program works. As the target audience is aged between 14 to 18, using social media channels will help attract and reach out to more youngsters. They spend most of their time on social media sites such as Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, et al. Showcasing sponsored posts or ads on these websites will help boost the audience reach for the program. The challenge with this is deciding how to advertise the program in such a way that it entices the target audience to at least apply for the apprenticeship. Another way of reaching the target audience is to visit job fairs in schools which are within 30 miles of each dealership where the apprentices work. This will convince the students to apply as they know it's not very far and additionally reduces the operational cost for Ferrari in advertising this program to them. The decorative props used at the Ferrari Challenge Series can be utilized at these same job fairs. Ferrari can also provide an incentive to young applicants in the form of a trip to the Ferrari Museum and Factory in Italy. It will only be applicable to the young adults who enroll when they are in school. The lucky ones get a three night trip in Italy. Ferrari will provide the transport and accommodation for these candidates as well as cover their tour of the museum and the factory in Modena. However, all the meals and other activities in the museum or in Italy will be borne by the candidates. The trip begins by the candidates arriving in Milan on a Thursday night and departing on Sunday evening. They will be taken to the museum tour on Friday with Saturday being assigned to explore Milan. The budget has been designed very conservatively 
the apprenticeship program already has a kiosk as a challenge series so the additional cost of handling and transporting the hands-on prop should cost around 500 pounds for the whole year similarly attending job fairs should be another 500 pounds as of now the total expenditure on the campaign is 1000 pounds if the candidates qualify for the Italy trip, another £2,000 will be added to the overall budget. But the budget for the Italy trip is flexible. For the purpose of this presentation, an estimate of 10 candidates has been taken. This is based on a previous statistic which mentioned that out of 1,100 applicants, only 11 were selected to the apprenticeship program. So an assumption is taken into consideration that all applicants that year will be from the young adult apprenticeship program the travel cost which includes airfare trains and buses will be 800 pounds with the accommodation and museum tours costing 400 pounds each so to conclude attracting teenagers from 14 to 18 is a difficult task but not impossible currently it's tough to engage a teenager's interest into new things and it's even harder to sustain that this is the biggest challenge that Ferrari will face undertaking the campaign. To entice young adults, it is crucial to think like them and understand what will pique their interest. Thank you.